1994, a Miami, Florida woman saw the face of the Virgin Mary in her homemade grilled cheese sandwich. Many believers called it a miracle. It's a miracle! Apparently, God was so busy burning Mary's image onto the sandwich, he was unable to prevent a tornado from slamming into a church in Piedmont, Alabama on Palm Sunday, where 20 of his children died and 90 were injured. The sandwich also took precedence over four plane crashes, a ferry accident, and the highway chase involving a certain O.J. Simpson. A Virgin Mary sandwich was more important. And the woman sold it 10 years later on eBay for $28,000. Praise to the Father, the Son, and the Holy Toast. In November of 2004, Fred Juan of Ontario, Canada looked onto his oven sheet and saw the face of Jesus on a burned fish stick. Many of the faithful claimed it was a genuine miracle. It's a miracle! One month later, on December 26, 2004, the Great Indian Ocean Tsunami unleashed the energy of 23,000 atomic bombs, drowning 230,000. The Canadian Jesus fish stick was unaffected. In related news, Dan and Sarah Bell of Dallas, Texas discovered a praying Jesus inside a bag of Cheetos in 2009. And across the pond, two guys in London's flat white espresso bar created their own Jesus in the form of a medium-sized latte. This last incident wasn't a miracle per se, we just thought it was funny. In Sacramento, California in 2005, believers were drawn to the Vietnamese Catholic Martyrs Church, where a statue of Mary appeared to weep blood from its left eye. Hundreds came to pay homage to this genuine miracle. It's a miracle! Of course, to a closed-minded, hell-bound heathen, this event might have paled in comparison to a man-made wonder on July 4th of that same year, where NASA scientists had successfully flown a spacecraft the size of a Volkswagen 83 million miles into deep space over six months to remotely launch a probe to explode on the surface of a comet, which was itself traveling 23,000 miles per hour in another direction and hit it perfectly. Man's accomplishment was pretty lame compared to a few red stains on an inanimate statue in an obscure church, don't you think? First photographed in the late 19th century by amateur photographer Secondo Pia and displayed in the Royal Chapel of the Cathedral of St. John the Baptist is the famous Shroud of Turin which many believers claim bears the imprinted image of Christ from his burial after the crucifixion. It's a miracle! In October of 2009, an Italian scientist was able to fake an identical shroud by painting a cloth with pigment and baking it in a large oven. It's unclear whether he used the same oven that was used for the fish stick and the grilled cheese sandwich. Yes, the faithful see wondrous divine manifestations all around them. They know that God may not intervene in the world's most significant events, but He will provide proof of Himself in the small, unimportant things that might have happened anyway. And then the church will praise God and celebrate, and call these things evidence that God is our Father who dearly loves all of us. It's amazing. It's supernatural. It's a miracle.